Pennsylvania is slowly improving when it comes to COVID-19 vaccinations. Governor Tom Wolf now credits an order he signed last month as reason for that improvement. Fox 43's Chelsea Kerbler joins us live to explain where Pennsylvania stands with its vaccination process. Chelsea, good morning. Good morning, Matt. Well, when you look at data and rankings, there are a lot out there as far as when it comes to COVID-19 vaccinations. But in Pennsylvania, when it comes to the percent of people who have received at least the first dose of the COVID-19 vaccine, Pennsylvania is ranking 17th. Now, the state was ranked 30th a month ago, and Governor Tom Wolf believes the improvement came after ordering providers give out 80% of the vaccine doses they have with se within seven days of receiving them. The state has given out 4.5 million doses of the vaccine. 2.9 million people have been partially vaccinated with one dose and 1.5 million people have been fully vaccinated receiving both doses. The use of the Johnson and Johnson vaccine has helped boost vaccination numbers as people are fully vaccinated after one shot. The state reached an all time high of 104,000 shots into arms on Friday, March 12th and hit more than 100,000 vaccines in a day three times last week. The Wolf administration has committed to ensuring everyone currently eligible in phase 1A will have access to a vaccine appointment by the end of the month, although it's currently unknown if the state will reach that goal. Lindsay Malden with the State Department of Health told Fox 43 the department is currently in talks about opening up phase 1B and as the state's vaccine supply continues to grow each week, she expects the state will be able to move through phases 1B and C a lot faster than what we've seen with phase 1A. And as more and more people become vaccinated, the state has amended its face covering order to align with the U.S. Centers for Disease Control and Prevention. Fully vaccinated people can now visit with other fully vaccinated people indoors without wearing a mask or socially distancing. They can also visit unvaccinated people from a single household who are at low risk for severe COVID-19 without wearing a mask or social distancing. Now, people who are fully vaccinated don't have to quarantine or test if they've been exposed to someone who has COVID-19 as long as they are asymptomatic. However, uh, health officials are asking people who are vaccinated to still follow some mitigation orders, especially when out in public places to wear a face mask and socially distance. In Harrisburg, Chelsea Kerbler, Fox 43 News.